Doordarshan abbreviated in English as DD is an autonomous public service broadcaster founded by the Government of India, which is owned by the Broadcasting Ministry of India and is one of two divisions of Prasar Bharati. It is one of India's largest broadcasting organisations in terms of studio and transmitter infrastructure, having been established on 15 September 1959. It also broadcasts on digital terrestrial transmitters. DD provides television, radio, online and mobile services throughout metropolitan and regional India, as well as overseas, through the Indian Network and Radio India. History Beginnings <inaudible> 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 Doordarshan had a modest beginning as an experimental telecast starting in Delhi on 14 September 1959, with a small transmitter and a makeshift studio. Regular daily transmission started in 1965 as a part of All India Radio. Doordarshan began a five-minute news bulletin in the same year. Pratima Puri was the first newsreader. Salma Sultan joined Doordarshan in 1967, and later became a news anchor. Krishi Darshan started telecast on Doordarshan on 26 January 1967 and is the longest running program on Indian television. The television service was extended to Bombay and Amritsar in 1972. Up until 1975, only seven Indian cities had a television service and Doordarshan remained the sole provider of television in India. Television services were separated from radio on 1 April 1976. Each office of All India Radio and Doordarshan was placed under the management of two separate director generals in New Delhi. Finally, in 1982, Doordarshan took shape as a national broadcaster. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Nationwide transmission. National telecasts DD National were introduced in 1982. In the same year, Colour TV was introduced to India with the live telecast of the Independence Day speech by the Prime Minister of India, Indira Gandhi, on 15 August 1982. This was followed by the Colour telecast of 1982 Asian Games held in Delhi. For the 2012 Summer Olympics, live telecasts of the opening and closing ceremonies of the Games were broadcast on its national channel. DD Sports provided round the clock coverage of sport events. On 17 November 2014, Doordarshan relaunched with a new theme of pink and purple, accompanied by a new punchline, Desh Ka APNA channel, meaning, the country's own channel. It was announced by Vijayalaxmi Chabra, Director General of Doordarshan. As of 2017, Doordarshan transmits through a network of nearly 1,400 terrestrial transmitters. There are about 46 Doordarshan studios producing TV programs. Topic channels Doordarshan operates 34 channels, two All India channels DD National and DD News 16 regional language satellite channels RLSC, 11 state networks SN, an international channel, a sports channel, DD Sports, DD Bharati, DD Urdu and DD Kizan, on DD National aka DD1, regional programs and local programs are carried on a time-sharing basis. DD News Channel, launched on 3 November 2003, which replaced the DD Metro formerly known as the DD2 Entertainment Channel, provides 24-hour news service. These channels are relayed by all terrestrial transmitters in the country. The regional languages satellite channels have two components, the regional service for the particular state relayed by all terrestrial transmitters in the state and additional programs in the regional language in prime time and non-prime time available only through cable operators. DD Sports Channel is exclusively devoted to the broadcasting of sporting events of national and international importance. This is the only sports channel which telecasts rural sports like Ko Ko and Kabaddi. A new regional channel DD Arun Prabha 24-7 satellite television channel focused on northeastern region was scheduled for a launch on 15 February 2018. However, launch of the channel put on hold due to multiple issues. Topic. Current channels Topic. National channel Topic. 
Topic: Regional Language Channel. Topic: Regional State Network. The regional state networks cater to the people living in Hindi Belt and other state who does not have DD channel as their own. The programs of this service are produced and broadcast from the capital of the respective states between 3.00 and 8 p.m. and are relayed by all the ground transmitters of the state. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> International Channel. Topic. Closed or renamed channels DD2 from 1984 to 1993 later renamed to DD Metro DD Metro from 1993 to 2003 later converted to DD News Metro Gold from October 2000 to September 2001 aired on DD Metro DD International from March 1995 to September 2000 later renamed to DD World DD World from September 2000 to January 2002 later renamed to DD India DDCNNI from the 30th of June 1995 to the 31st of May 1997 DD3 from 1995 to 1996 later merged with DD Movie Club and the new channel was named as DD3 Movie Club DD Movie Club from 1995 to 1996 later merged with DD3 and the new channel was named DD3 Movie Club DD3 Movie Club from 1996 to 1998 later converted to DD Sports Topic <laughs> <laughs> International Broadcasting DD India is broadcast internationally via satellite it is available in 146 countries worldwide, however, information on receiving this channel in other countries is not easily available. In the UK, DD India was available through the Eurobird satellite on the Sky System on Channel 833 the logo is shown as Rayet TV. Transmissions via Sky Digital ceased in June 2008 and those via DirecTV in the United States in July 2008. Topic Criticism Topic Allegations of State Control Prasar Bharati is the parent body of Doordarshan, and has all board members appointed by the Government of India acting through the Information and Broadcasting Ministry. It had been actively used especially during the emergency for government propaganda. During Operation Blue Star in 1984, only government sources were used for reporting the story. Here, Doordarshan was complicit in the production of a video that claimed acts of violence which when investigated by independent journalists were found to be false. In 2004, it censored the airing of a controversial documentary on Jayaprakash Narayan, one of the opposition leaders during the emergency. When Doordarshan broadcast the 70-minute long Vijayadashami speech of Mohan Bhagwat, the leader of the Rashtriya Swayamsevak Sangh RSS, the Narendra Modi administration and the BJP were criticized for misusing the public broadcaster. While Director General of DD, Archana Data issued a clarification on speech and said, speech was like any other news event therefore we covered it. Commercial viability After private television channels were allowed in 1991, Doordarshan has seen a steep decline in viewership in homes, due to general public acceptance of cable and satellite television, which in 2002 was just at 2.38% for DD National. While it earns significant advertising revenue due to the compulsory feed given to it by the highest bidder to national events, including cricket tournaments, there has been a proposal to give it funds by imposing a license fee to own a television in India. See also All India Radio Lok Sabha TV Raja Sabha TV DD Free Dish Ministry of Information and Broadcasting India 
List of programs broadcast by DD National